This video will show you how to program and perform a factory reset on an ATV320 drive. To get started from your main menu, you want to go ahead and press enter on your dial and you want to scroll down into the menu C O N F. You can go clockwise, enter on C O N F. And then you want to go into FCS dash, enter. And the next parameter you want to go down to is FRY dash. So you can scroll down clockwise, enter on FRY dash. So in here you basically are selecting whether you want to reset all groups or um, function blocks only or drive parameters only etc so if you want to do all the groups just go ahead and click enter on all and uh, you'll notice that your little quotation marks are going to be on the top instead of bottom here that's how you select whether it's on all or not once that's done you escape out again just to make sure it's, it's all here and then once that's done you want to escape back to FRY dash and then scroll down to GFS next one down and then enter so defaults are obviously no for factory reset so you want to go ahead and scroll down to yes and then press and hold for about three seconds and it should go back to GFS automatically once you let go of the button. So that's basically how you do a factor reset. Just a matter of going into the FCS dash menu and then finding the FRY dash submenu in there. Making sure you select your groups all. Again, keep in mind of the quotations on the bottom or the top, depending on whether you want to perform a factor reset or not. And uh, making sure that you hold the enter dial on the drive for about three seconds when you actually want to perform the factor reset on the appropriate parameter.